every straight line can be represented by a linear equation. Any point which satisfies the equation of a line lies on that line. Second point, any point through which a line passes will always satisfy the equation of that line. Any point which satisfies the equation of a line lies on that line. So exercise 14a, we are doing using that point. Find which of the following points lie on the line x minus 2y plus 5 is equal I to 0. Fourteen A first one. Find the equation x minus two y plus five z equal to zero. We can't hear you. I mean, tell me in group so that is better. What is your doubt? I have a No, 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 no. This is the text itself. Six minus two y plus five is equal to zero. Then, what we can, what we want to do? Hmm? One, three is our question. One, three. Substitute the values. <laughs> it is true. It is true or not that you have to write. It is true. So point one three. This is our question. So equation of the line. Equation of line is x minus two y plus five is equal to zero. Then substituting this is what x and this is y. Substituting x is equal to one and y is equal to three in x minus 2y plus 5z equal to 0. Or we can write it as, let it be equation number 1, in equation number 1. That also you can write. Either this way or substituting x is equal to 1 and y is equal to 3. In x minus 2y plus 5 is equal to 0. Then substitute 1 minus 2 into 3 plus 5z equal to 0. So 1 minus 6 plus 5 is equal to 0. Negative 5 plus 5 is equal to 0. Which is true. It is true. The 1 comma 3 satisfies, satisfies the equation. Whether it satisfies the equation or not, we have to find out. So, 1, 3 satisfies the equation. Then do question number 2. 0, 5. Same. Instead of x, complete the first one, no? Then second. Second question. 0, same question. 0, same equation. 0, 5. So, what we want to write? Substituting x is equal to 0 and y is equal to 5. In x minus 2y plus 5 is equal to 0. x is 0 minus 2 into 5 plus 5 is equal to 0.
Then remaining questions from work, do it. Then third one, fourth and fourth, fifth and sixth, form of pain. Do it. Second one, no need. If it is in the first semester, means we need that, but second, this is the second semester, so need no need of two or four. Offline exam, so it won't be, I think. The next third question. The lines given by the equation 2x minus y by 3 is equal to 7 passes through the point k6. Calculate the value of k. So how can we say? Same equation of the line is given as what? Instead of x and y, we want to substitute it as what? Instead of x, we can substitute it as k. Instead of y, same method. Instead of y, we can write it as 6. From there, we will get the value of k. So, what we can do? The equation of the line. Right now. Given what? k6 passes through the equation. 2x minus y by 3 is equal to 7. So, substitute x is equal to k and y is equal to 6. Are you here? Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. So, what we can write? Third question. Substituting x is equal to k. Huh? Substituting x is equal to k and y is equal to k. Since they gave what? Since that point lies on the equation that is given in the question. Since what? k6. This already said that we don't want to find out whether it satisfies or not. Already it is given that what k6 satisfies satisfy the equation. What? If it satisfies the equation, what 2x minus y by 3 is equal to 7. Here. Is given that k6 satisfies the equation, this one. So we can directly substitute the value of x as what? Therefore, substituting k and x is equal to k and y is equal to 6 in this equation. In this equation, substituting x is equal to k and y is equal to 6 in this equation, it will become what? 2x minus y by 3 is equal to 7 becomes implies 2 into x can be replaced as k minus y means 3 divided 6 divided by 3 is equal to 7. So 2k minus 2 is equal to 7. So 2k is equal to 7 plus 2. Therefore k is equal to 9 by 2. k is equal to what? Four point five. Four point five. So we have to find the value of k. Four point five. What is the difference between the first question and the third question? Anyone, please. Anyone. First question. First question is to find whether the equation satisfies or not. Satisfies or not. So. Third question it is satisfied and we have to find the value. Value of x. Already given it satisfies. So no need of writing which is true. It is already true the. Okay. Then third. Then third second. Third, fourth question. Do it now itself. Find the value of k. Same way. Fourth question. For what value of k will the point 3 negative k lie on the equation? What? Lie on that line? 9x plus 4y is equal to 3. Same model since what? Fourth question. Since 
same way we can write three negative k satisfies the equation. Instead of this, we can write it as what same or do it. Substituting. Answer. K equal to six. K is equal to six. Okay. K equal to six. Twenty-seven minus four K is equal to three. So twenty-seven negative three is equal to take that negative to the right side. Four K twenty-seven minus three is what twenty-four is equal to four K. So k is equal to 24 divided by 4. 6 fours are 24. So k is equal to 6. Then next one. The line 3x by 5 minus 2y by 3 plus 1 is equal to 0 contains the point m 2m minus 1. Calculate the value of m. Same no contains m and 2m minus 1 means what? It satisfies the equation. Is equal to m and y is equal to m minus one. X is equal to m and y is equal to two m minus one. Substitute that in that equation. Three x by five minus two y by three plus one is equal to zero. Then find the value of m. Start doing question number five. m comma 2m minus 1. So this will be x and this will be y. Satisfies equation 3x by 5 equal to 0. Write all the steps same as the previous question 3 and 4. So instead of x replace it as m 3m by 5 minus 2 into instead of y we have two terms, so within brackets 2m minus 1 divided by 3 plus 1 is equal to 0. Then LCM. Three into three, nine m minus five into two, ten into two m minus one divided by five into three, fifteen plus one is equal to zero. Change the bracket 9m minus 10 into 2, 20m plus 10 divided by 15 is plus 1 is equal to 0. Nine M minus 20m. Which method you are applying again LCM or take that negative one to the right side and cross multiply. If you are taking uh, one to the right side, it will become negative one. Negative 11 M plus 10 divided by 15. We have to find out the value of M. So negative one can be written as negative one by one cross multiply. So it will be negative 11 M plus 10 is equal to negative 15. Negative 11 and take to the right side. So it will become positive 11 and 
10 already there in the left side, take this negative to left side, so positive. 15, 15 plus 10, 25 is equal to 11 m, therefore m is equal to 25 by 11, convert that into mixed fraction. What will be 25 by 11? 2, 3 by 11. 2, 3 by 11. 2, 3 by 11. Then 6th row state. Does the line 3x minus 5y minus is equal to 6 bisect the join of 5 negative 2 and negative 1, 2? Does the line 3x minus 5y is equal to 6 bisect the join of 5 negative 2 and negative 1, 2. What is the meaning of that? Bisect the join of 5 negative 2 and negative 1, 2. Does the line. We have to find it. Uh. Which is equal to 0 or not. Hmm. Does the line, which line? This one. Line, which is that line? 3x minus 5y is equal to 6. Does that line hmm, bisects the join of which one? Another two points are there. Suppose this is 5 negative, uh, 5 negative 2. Another point. Another point, which one? 1, negative 1, 2. Let it be this. Two points are there. Does the line? 3x minus 5y bisect the join of bisect the join of which one? Can we find midpoint ma'am? Ah, very good. So what we have to find out? Bisect the bisect means midpoint, you know, equal. So which midpoint we have to find out? Midpoint of find the midpoint of which one? 5, negative 2 and a negative 1, 2. So that point we will get. Where they are bisecting, that point we will get. Understood the difference? One slide on the line. This line, one line. That's two points. This is one line. We will get two lines. Bisect is not the same. That is 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 Join our line to touch in the Arian angle in the Giana Madinde. He ran the points in there, midpoint to do it. So E point in the top. Other A the line is satisfied Chayanam. E line is satisfied Chayanam angle. A point, Petra point into the editor, midpoint editor. Five negative two. Suppose it is x1, y1. This is what? Negative 1, 2. That is x2, y2. Don't write first reason. x1, y1, x2, y2. So how can we find? Midpoint. Huh. Midpoint. Let it be P. P x1 x1 plus x2 by 2. Uh, x1 plus x2 by 2. Y1 y1 plus y2 by 2. Okay. So x1. 5 plus x2 means negative 1 divided by 2. Y1 plus Y2 by 2 means negative 2 plus 2 by 2. So 5 minus 1 by 2, 0 by 2. That is 4 by 2, comma 0. That is 2, comma 0. So this point P we got it as what? 2, comma 0. Don't write first listen. 2, 0. Then, does the line 3x minus 5y is equal to 6 bisect the join of these two points. So what we want to do? 
തുല്യമായി ബൈസെറ്റ് ചെയ്യാന്ന് പറഞ്ഞാൽ എന്താ ഈ പോയിന്റ് ഇവിടെ കിട്ടിയ പോയിന്റ് തുല്യമായി കാണോ എന്ത് ചെയ്യുന്നത് ഡിവൈഡ് ചെയ്യുന്നത് എന്ന് അറിയണമെങ്കിൽ എന്ത് ചെയ്യണം നമുക്ക് ടു സീറോ എന്ന പോയിന്റ് ഈ ഇക്വേഷനിൽ വരുന്നുണ്ടെങ്കിൽ വരുന്നുണ്ടോ അതായത് സാറ്റിസ്ഫൈ ചെയ്യുന്നുണ്ടോ എന്ന് നമ്മൾ നോക്കണം സോ ത്രീ എക്സ് മൈനസ് ഫൈവ് ബൈ സി ഇക്വൽ ടു സിക്സ് സബ്സ്റ്റ്യൂട്ട് എക്സ് ഇസ് ഈക്വൽ ടു ടു ആൻഡ് വൈ ഇസ് ഈക്വൽ ടു സീറോ ഇൻ ദിസ് ഇക്വേഷൻ ഇഫ് ഇറ്റ് സാറ്റിസ്ഫൈസ് വി ക്യാൻ സേ ദാറ്റ് ഇറ്റ് ബൈസെക്സ് ദ ജോയിൻ ഓഫ് നെഗറ്റീവ് ഫൈവ് ഫൈവ് നെഗറ്റീവ് ടു ആൻഡ് നെഗറ്റീവ് വൺ ടു ഇസ് ഇറ്റ് ക്ലിയർ point 2 by 6 the join of phi negative 2 negative 1 2 don't simply substitute x is equal to and y is equal to 2 in phi negative 2 and negative 1 2 angane cheyirudu ee question vanna odane ningal cheyyunnathu ariyade 3x minus 5y is equal to 6 la either you will substitute negative 1 2 as xy or sometimes xy like this way substituting this value adalla nammalodu choichirikkana whether that X by satisfies the equation or not? And all that you can do. Whether that equation, which one satisfies? Whether that does the equation bisects the join of? If the bisect is given, then do. Either this, either ah midpoint and the point. If you are going to do this, either bisect is given, then this point bisect is given, then do. Ah point, then we will do. Ah, this can be done. Okay, so right. Midpoint of phi negative two midpoint of phi negative two negative one two is equal to let p be the midpoint let the p x y be the midpoint. point of pi negative 2 negative 1 to the p x y is equal to like this 
which is the joining point. Joining point is 2, 0. Since the line 3x minus 5y is equal to 6, bisect the join of 5 negative 2 and negative 1, 2. Uh, we can substitute. We can substitute what? We can substitute. X is equal to 2. X is equal to 2. And uh, y is equal to 0 in which equation? 3x minus 5y is equal to 6. Which implies what? 3 into 2 minus 5 into 0 is equal to 6. 6 minus 0 is equal to 6. 6 is equal to 6. Which is true. Which is true. Therefore, the given line bisects the points. Join of the points, finite. Therefore, the given line. Therefore, the given line. Whether it is bisects or not. Therefore, the given line bisects the joining of pi negative 2 and another point negative 1, 2. Okay, that's the next thing I've got today.